a massive police operation is underway in northeast of Paris, as the search for two suspects responsible for the heinous killing of 12 people at French magazine earlier in the week, intensified, local media and the Interior Ministry have confirmed. Local media said witnesses reported on Friday a high-speed car chase and gunshots as police chased the suspects on a French highway outside Paris. The latest developments come as heavily armed anti-terrorism police swooped on residential areas northeast of Paris in an extensive manhunt for two brothers suspected of being behind killing at satirical weekly, Charlie Hebdo. Al Jazeera's Lawrence Lee, reporting from De Martin and Goal, around 30 kilometers northeast of Paris, on Friday, said the entire area was under lockdown amid multiple reports filtering through of the men's whereabouts in the area. It is also understood that the men may have taken a hostage. Police have sealed the area as part of their attempt to isolate Anstrell's area. People have been told to stay in their offices and not move around, our correspondent said. Officers said the operation began after witnesses cited the two men said to be responsible for the attack on Charlie Hebdo in a town in the Picardy region, adding that their hijacked getaway car was found in the same area. Al Jazeera's Jackie Rowland, reporting from Paris, said the manhunt was approaching its final moments. The manager of a petrol station near the Villers Cotterit commune in Picardy said he recognized the two men suspected of having participated in the attack against Charlie Hebdo, police sources said. Al Jazeera's Lawrence Lee reports from Paris on the French media's reaction to the attack. Villers Cotterit is located approximately 80 kilometers northeast of Paris. The latest getaway car of the attackers, who hijacked multiple vehicles after the incident, was found abandoned around the same area. The identity cards of the suspects and petrol bombs were found in the abandoned car. Two of the alleged attackers, who are also brothers, have been identified as 32-year-old said Kachi and 34-year-old Sheriff Kachi. Police said they are French-born sons of Algerian-born parents. The two men along with another person who is believed to be a teenager, are thought to have carried out Wednesday's attack before escaping in a car. In a news conference late on Thursday, Interior Minister Bernard Cazeneuve said the younger brother was known French security forces, adding that he had had links to al-Qaeda in 2004 and 2005. He added that said Kamachi had been under security surveillance. 2012 interview with Charlie Hebdo Stefan Charbonnier who died in the attack. Suspect jailed before. Earlier, police said that Karachi was imprisoned for 18 months for trying to travel to Iraq to fight for armed groups. Nine people have been detained in relation to the investigation, Kazanyuv also said. Al Jazeera's Barnaby Phillips, reporting from Picardy said there has been intense activity by counterterrorism police in the region where the suspects had been spotted. Newspapers refused to be silenced. Lien La Presse assassinate the murdered press. Independent G. Sue's Charlie I am Charlie. Les Declare News Sums House Charlie We are all Charlie. La Provence Charlie Hebdo Le Jour Noir Charlie Hebdo The Black Day. The Parisinals need to earn Paul La Liberty They will not kill freedom. The Guardian An Assault on Democracy The Daily Telegraph War on Freedom The Sun Nun Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more updates. Don't forget to like the video.